Hello everyone. In this video, we will guide you on how to check if your computer supports Hyper-V. For your information only, to run Hyper-V, your computer must have a 64-bit processor with second-level address translation, SLAT, and the processor must support VM monitor mode extension, VTC on Intel chips. Apart from that, your Windows 11 or 10 machine should have a minimum of 4 GB RAM. You should also check whether the virtualization technology and hardware enforced data execution prevention options are enabled on the system firmware. To check if your computer supports Hyper-V, first press Windows and then R key on the keyboard to open the Run dialog box. Here, type CMD and press Control Shift Enter from the keyboard. Now your PC will prompt for user account control. Click on the yes button. Then elevated command prompt window will open. Here type system info and press enter on the keyboard. At the bottom of the result, check for Hyper V requirements section. Here, if you see a hypervisor has been detected then you are good to go. Your PC supports Hyper-V, but it is not enabled on your PC. But, if you read VM monitor mode extensions, virtualization enabled in firmware, second level address translation, and data execution prevention available to YES, then your computer supports Hyper-V as well enabled. However, for any option, if you read no, then your PC does not support Hyper-V. Let me know via comment how this video is. Do you like more videos like this? Subscribe to our channel Garup Windows. Goodbye. See you in the next video.